Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Talk Sports in South Jersey, the 2018 FIFA World Cup edition. We'll talk about the FIFA World Cup in just a little bit. But first, let's talk about our local teams, starting with the Philadelphia Phillies. What has gotten into the Philadelphia Phillies? They'll be taking on the St. Louis Cardinals tomorrow and Wednesday. They will be off on Thursday. And then they'll travel from Philadelphia to Washington, D.C. Uh, to take on Jason Worth and Bryce Harper on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. They are 37 and 32 on the season. They are four games behind the Atlanta Braves. Please, Philadelphia, you have to pass the Washington Nationals this week. And will 2018 be the year the Phillies become World Series champions? Absolutely not. The way the Phillies have been playing, they will never become World Series champions. And now let's talk about the Philadelphia Union. They are off until Saturday as they will take on the Vancouver Whitecaps at Talent Energy Stadium in Chester, Pennsylvania. They have 18 points on the season. Will 2018 be the year that the Philadelphia Union become MOS Cup champions? Again, absolutely not! The way the Philadelphia Union have been playing, they will never become MLS Cup champions! And now, it's time to talk about Philadelphia Soul Football. The arena football season is almost over. The Philadelphia Soul is 5-4 on the season. They will take on the Washington Valor on Saturday. Will 2018 be the year that the Philadelphia Soul become arena football champions? Absolutely not! The way they have been playing, they will never become arena football champions this year. We will talk more about our local teams next week. It's time for what are they up to now. We've been talking about the 2008 Phillies World Series team. This week we will talk about Phillies pitcher number 35, Cole Hamels. Cole was born on December 27, 1983, which makes him 34 years old. Cole made his Major League debut on May 12, 2006 for the Philadelphia Phillies. He played for the Philadelphia Phillies from 2006 through 2015. He was traded to the Texas Rangers on July 31, 2015. Cole helped the Phillies win the World Series in 2008. On July 25, 2015, he pitched a no-hitter against the Chicago Cubs in Chicago at Wrigley Field. Hamels, who is of Dutch descent, is the oldest of three children. He grew up in San Diego where his parents still live. Cole and his wife Heidi Strobel, whom he married on December 31, 2006, continue to raise their children in Philadelphia. They had their first child, son Caleb Michael, on October 9, 2009 and their second son, Braxton, on November 2, 2011. On Christmas Eve 2012, they adopted a baby girl from Ethiopia named Reeve. Han was created and currently runs an organization known as the Hamels Foundation with his wife, Heidi. The foundation was created in 2008. The Hamels Foundation funds childhood programs in Philadelphia and Africa. Cole and his wife Heidi have donated their $10 million Missouri mansion to a children's charity. There are tons of amazing charities in southwest Missouri. Out of all of these, Barnabas really pulled on our heartstrings, says Cole Hamels, seeing the faces, hearing the laughter, reading the stories of the kids they serve. There is truly nothing like it. Barnabas makes dreams come true, and we felt called to help them in a big way. The 32,000 square foot home with more than 100 acres of land. It's the largest ever donation to the charity which offers camping experiences to kids with special needs and their siblings. I would like to wish the Hamels the best in everything they do. It's time for This Week in Sports History. Everything happening around in the world of sports. On June 18th, 1916. The Yankees score in every inning but the eighth to beat the Indians 19-3 in baseball. June 19, 1846, the first officially recognized baseball game played by Cartwright Wolves 
New York Knights 23 defeat Knickerbockers at Hoboken, New Jersey. June 20th, 1912, the New York Baseball Giants lead 14-2 into the ninth inning and win 21-12. That was a crazy ninth inning. June 21st, 1916, Boston pitcher Wu Forrester no hits the New York Yankees 2-0. June 22nd, 1889, the Louisville Colonels set a major league record with 26 consecutive loss. June 23, 1918, the Boston Red Sox Dutch Leonard's second no-hitter beats the Tigers 5-0. And on June 24, 1894, the modern Olympics were decided to be held every four years. I'll have more sports history fun facts next week. It's time to recap the 2018 FIFA World Cup. The pool play matches are underway. Which teams will take home the World Cup trophy? As of Monday, June 18th, Russia and Uruguay are leading with three points each in Group A. Iran is leading Group B with three points. Portugal and Spain have one point each. In Group C, France is tied with Denmark with three points each. Croatia leads Group D with three points. Argentina and Iceland are tied with one point. In Group B, Serbia leads Brazil and Switzerland with three points to their one point each. Mexico and Sweden are tied in Group F with three points. Belgium and England are tied with three points in Group G. Group H has yet to play. I am predicting Russia winning the World Cup this year. I'll have to wait and see if I picked correctly. And that is it. You can listen to Let's Talk Sports through my Facebook page at Stefan Sports Radio or through the podcast app or this YouTube channel. Talk to you soon and keep those comments rolling and we will talk to you next week.